Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Friday Night Restaurant Reviews. Missy Jen, and once in a while, we get to uh, pull into the bank, right? Once in a while, we get to uh, re-review restaurants that we've been to before, especially since uh, building up new, uh, new reviews here on the Murphy Channel. One of the places that I really loved when it comes to burgers is Burger King. And we want to go back today and Roll see see Missy Jen if they still are as good as they were the first time we went up. Now, I really like the burgers because they're flame broiled. There's something better about the taste, I think. And uh, Missy Jen, you didn't like the fries, but you did like the burgers. So, yeah, you know, we went around good. and we did a test. We'll probably do that again this summer. We're going to do a triple comparison again. Burger King, McDonald's, and Wendy's. But we're going to eat it all three first to make sure that we have get the uh, individual... Uh, we're going to get the individual, what you say, uh, analysis of each one of them. Anyway, it is a beautiful, bright, sunny day uh, here. Finally, Missy Jen, we have some degrees. 80 degrees and glorious. Finally. Finally. So we will see you over at the Burger King. I think that's gonna do it. Okay, it'll be two to one night. Okay. Always a very, uh, very neat operation here. If you look around, the floor is always very clean. Never see any trash around. I really commend these guys for running a first-class operation here. Two or two, one chicken and one beef to try stuff out here. So, all right. And, uh, Missy Jen got the Oreo shake. So all in. That's a lot of food. We got kind of the specials for twenty-three sixty-four, huh, Jen? 
Yeah, it's 2178 plus tax, which isn't bad. Better than that is a six. That's a great deal. Yeah. Alright, so let's uh, move this and let's get ourselves set up here. Got a whopper and a chicken. I got a. That's a Pretty good. Oh. First thing Jen's doing is trying out the uh, fries here. And what do you think, Jen? They have really improved them. Improved them a little bit? Really good. Try a taste of that. They're really good. I'm going to make them. Oh, yeah. To me, the fries taste about the same as last time. There's not like no salt on them at all or anything. All right. Well, this is, what are you going to try first? Your chicken, or are you going to try the Whopper there? Well, I'm going to chicken. Okay. Here comes the chicken. That's the presentation. Looks pretty good on there. It's a pretty good assembled. Got some sauce on it. Oh, that does look pretty good. Lettuce, tomato. Yeah. So these are two for yeah, two for nice six. Yeah, thick pad on it. Yeah, let me pad. just take a look at that there. Yeah, that looks pretty, uh, pretty Crispy righteous. Chicken. Yep. Let's try it out. See if it's decent to chicken or if it's flubbery or anything. Okay. Sometimes these fast food places, the chicken gets a little flubbery and stuff. It's pretty good. Huh? It's real chicken. Well, I hope so. I mean, it actually tastes like chicken. Huh? Tastes really good. Okay. Oh, Excellent. So we're gonna switch off. I'm gonna uh, go ahead and try the burger now. Very good. Okay. America's favorite burger. Going to hit the whopper here. And good presentation on here. Decent with the uh, onions, the pickles. This looks good. Let's go ahead and try a bite. Switch off and we'll take a bite of our, uh, or we'll actually switch off and try a bite of our chicken. I'll get the chicken and she'll try it as well.
again, you're trying to add that whopper. Let you chew a little bit of that, but uh, always a very nice presentation there. The chock full of goodness. Lots of beef in there. Two sandwiches for six. Pretty it good, is huh? It's very good. It's. Uh, Can you taste the difference is, that uh, that uh, beef makes there? It's a very large, very large. Yeah, it's a big size. Bag. It's a very big burger. Yeah. For three bucks, yeah. and it's got everything on it: lettuce, a lot of cream, onions, tomatoes, and really good chopped beef. Very delicious. All right, good deal. Enjoy. Another winner. Time for me to try the chicken. Probably a good sign when that chicken's hanging over, hanging <laughs> over the side. That's a real good sign that you got your money worth. And you also got a, uh, what was it, an Oreo oh, shake yes. too? Mm. That was pretty good. It's pretty oh, hard to... Yes. Yeah. I'm not sure if that's made from real ice cream or not, but, uh, you know, Burger King does a pretty good job, I think. It's not like Jack in the Box, but... It's not as good as Jack in the Box, but it is. It's pretty good. Yeah. Well, overall, I'm favorably impressed with the whole dining experience as usual. Burger King tonight, I could not possibly finish all the food. But you know, the whole gestalt is pretty good. good. We'll see you guys outside. We'll wrap it up. Alright, time to wrap it up. Our nice visit at uh, Burger King tonight. And I'll tell you, it did not disappoint as usual. The guy runs such a clean establishment in there. I think that's the thing that always impresses me. We traveled a lot of the country and I didn't always see real clean um, establishments where we eat. But this guy is pretty darn good in here with the way he keeps things. Uh, for me, the chicken was a real surprise, Missy Jen. It tasted totally different than other chickens that I've had before. It really tasted like a filet of Kentucky fried chicken. The spices and things were very similar, and I thought that it was, it was a tremendously great surprise today, and I really love the fact that uh, I can still be surprised at a place like uh, Burger King. So good for them. The uh, Whopper was all there as usual. The fries, and eh, they kind of leave me, I don't know, I never, they're too big in size. They, they're, you know, just leave it to McDonald's and Wendy's. I think we said before that they had the best fries. And we're gonna go again, we're gonna review McDonald's, we're gonna do Wendy's, then we're gonna go out and we're gonna have a one night comparison. We're gonna go around to all three establishments in hit at one time to check them out. So for me, it was a really good dining experience. Price was good, like 10 bucks a head. Eating there was great. And that included Missy Jen's got her uh, shake there too, so that's good. Makes her very, uh, very happy, <laughs> which is awesome. So I am going to go ahead and rate this a nine star experience. The only thing that would have made it perfect for me was some tastier fries, but uh, Missy Jen feels a little differently about the fries, but that's what makes uh, differences in people. So Jen, what did you think about uh, tonight? Um, I gotta say, I'm really pleasantly surprised about the chicken. And it was real meat. It wasn't some pressed patty or anything. That's what I had kind of anticipated to bite into. 
but it was real meat it was really flavorful it was even better in my opinion than Kentucky fried chicken it tasted even better yeah it's like without the bones <laughs> and, and for the price and everything really for three bucks for that big uh, sandwich can be that uh, and really that Whopper that really good price uh, ratio with three bucks for that big big of Whopper really good deal how about that flavor of it? Is it all there? Any flavor was all that sharp royal beef had all the toppings that you can wish for on it it was great and uh, yeah the fries could use a little bit more salt but I like them big and bulky so yeah and you like them less salt which is good for you <clears throat> and I like them less salty because that's healthier for you and the shake very very good <laughs> Uh, could be a little bit more milky, creamier, but it's still really, really delicious. And of course, they are very consistent with their cleanliness, which I am very, very, very picky important. about. Yeah. I love when an establishment is clean all the time. The chairs, the seats, the counters, no and everything. No trash around. All right, rate it up. And even the floor. So I rate this a nine point. Two, wow! <laughs> because I have to top We're Rosie. We're getting micro fancy. There we go. Because the fries, I <laughs> well, you got the shake, so <laughs> I got the shake, and then also the fries. I I like the fries. So uh, good deal. Well, there it is, guys. Uh, our review. It's been a couple years since we've been to the Burger King, but this place certainly stood the test of time, and I'm yes. really enjoying going back and re-reviewing some of these places so thank you so much for being along for another friday night restaurant reviews we've and, got uh, we've got hundreds more fridays and hundreds more restaurants if you're wondering this is the burger king here on stony point in santa rosa so if you're in the area check this burger king out all right everybody thanks so much for watching your thumbs up are really appreciated from burger king in santa rosa Thanks for being along for another Saturday night. Not Saturday, Friday, Friday night. night. Yeah. Thank you, Missy Jen. I haven't even started drinking. Thank you, everybody. I will in a minute. <laughs> All right, tough guy.